come with me for my first day of cancer appointments. Laughing, dancing and TikToking her way through her cancer journey. When Alari was diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma last month, she found a unique way to share the news. I didn't really know how to tell people. Um, in medical school, medical school, we learn how to break bad news, but I think when it's your bad news, it's a completely different situation. There was a lot of people that would want to know and that I'd want to tell, but I just didn't know how to tell. From scans to checkups and the precious bits of normal life in between, Aleri takes her 30,000 followers along with her on her cancer journey. It's been quite a good distraction for me. And I think that it's also been really nice that I've been able to get a message across to people that GPs are still open. Go and get lumps checked. If you've got something weird, go and get it checked. And it showed me how much people care, how much I value my life, how much I value freedom of health. It's, it's been looking for the positives in really dark places. So my plan is to get my hair cut short like here, donate, um, that's the Little Princess Trust. Um, when Alari starts chemotherapy, she's finding the silver lining in that too, donating her hair so that it can help someone else. Chatting to her online community about that has made her realise she's not alone. I think having any kind of illness or any kind of hard time, you can feel really, it can feel really lonely and you can feel quite isolated. And I think especially at the moment, a lot of people are feeling very lonely. And I think that these videos have kind of showed people that we're all going through something really tricky at the moment, but people are really kind and everyone, everyone cares about you. Ellery, I think a lot of people watching this will just be wondering how on earth do you stay so positive? It's definitely been hard to stay positive and there's definitely times where I've been like, you know, I'm really struggling with this, but it's definitely been a choice to just kind of think I've, I've got to make life easier for myself. I'm, I'm quite a happy person and I've got to stay the same person I am going through a hard time because it's the only way that I'm going to get through it. Alari is determined to beat this disease and most importantly, to face every step of it with a smile. <laughs> Charanpreet Kara, ITV News.